I'm having a little messy bun moment with like the two strands in front. I am loving blonde on me. But yeah. Okay, let me start the video. Hey guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. And I hope you stay and subscribe. Today's video is a what's on my iPhone. And I have the iPhone 11 in white. And it is a 64 gig phone if you guys like content like this um i will link down more my other videos my okay i'll link down my other what's on my phone videos down in the description or i'll try to put them up in the icon but if you guys just like see my face i would suggest you subscribe to my channel and watch my other videos because why not so um is that a red bird It has a red beak. Okay, let me stop getting distracted. So without further ado, let's get on to oh, what's on my iPhone 11. Let's get to screen recording in 3, 2, 1. Okay, this is my lock screen. And I'm going for this whole green theme. But like, let me show you my other lock screens that I made. This is the default lock screen that I got with the phone. And then this is the first lock screen I ever made. This is the second one. As you can see, I was going for a pink theme. But then I stayed on track with the flower theme and went for green. And this is the one that I'm using now. The one that I'm currently obsessed with because I'm currently obsessed with. And then this is the Uncle Waffles one that I made. And this is just one that I was like trying to do something. But then I failed miserably. So I just let it and just let it stay there so let me go into my apps so this is what you get when you open my phone but let me go to this part I, I don't know the name of this like I've heard this being said before but I just keep on, I keep on forgetting what like this space is called but the first widget which is the top widget is my contacts these are the people I talk to text regularly and then it's just like another widget of like my photos, my Google photos and like memories of it. And then this is just a bar with the time, with my battery. And sometimes it shows the battery of my AirPod cases and my AirPods. Like it shows that. And then we have this next widget, which is the same as the one on top, but it just shows my battery right now. And it also does the same thing when I have my AirPods in and it just shows how much battery I have in my AirPods. And then I have my Spotify, Spotify playlist, and then I have the weather widget, and then I have Steve. Steve, I play with for like 10 minutes every day. I don't know. It's just, it's just fun to play with it, right? So I just play with Steve for like 10 minutes every day, mostly in the bus on my way to classes. But yeah. And then we get the first page, and these three widgets are from Bridget Smith, and I get all my photos from Pinterest. So the first photo is just tulips. I also have the photos like right next to me. Will I have the link of the photos? No, I'll just have the photos right next to me. So the first app we have is YouTube. And this is my channel, which I suggest you guys subscribe. And there are the other, what's on my phone videos. And then I have Pinterest. Pinterest, on Pinterest, I just have things for my YouTube, for YouTube crocheting. Um, it's just random things youtube crocheting random dresses um lock screen inspirations and um my pins which are saved are just like here these are the pins and then like if you guys want to follow me on pinterest that is my account and then this is also the ones i created i also post some things here and there but like it's just here and there and then i have my instagram if you guys want to interact with me I suggest Instagram because most of the time, if not every day, I'm on Instagram posting stories. Do I post pictures? Not a lot, but stories, best way to interact with me. And then next I have TikTok and on TikTok you can see it's my account. My account is private and I do upload videos there and you guys could also follow me there on TikTok. Will I ever make my account private, my account public? I don't know. But like, it's there. And then we have this another huge widget, which is from Bridget Smith. 
just a random picture from Pinterest. And then we have my WhatsApp. My WhatsApp, ever since I got a new phone, I changed my number because I needed... I don't want to, like, pay for a SIM card just for me not to use, like, the data that comes with it. So I had to change my number. So I lost kind of, like, my contacts. And then for photos... I mean, for camera... I am loving this blonde. That's my camera. And then we have settings. I feel like settings is the same for everyone. It's just, it's styled differently, you know? And then I have my notes app, which is just notes. Don't ask me what my notes are. And then I have the last widget, which is just another widget of tulips. And if you notice the pattern, it's just tulips. I like flowers. Tulips may not be my number one flower, but it's in my top five. So, it's the theme for today. And then we have this big widget from Bridget Smith again, which is just green flowers. That's all. And now we're going to get into the first folder, which is productivity, where it has calendar, reminders, files, Steve, drive, home, and emails. Seven. Now, the only ones I use here is Steve. That's for when I have to customize, like, the Steve, like, at the control thingy. But other than that, there's just that. And then I have Drive, which I use to keep my very important documents. And then I have Mail. Yeah, it says I have 2,336 mails, but I read all the important ones. So, no, I don't. And then the next file is Photos and Videos, which I have CapCut, PixArt, Google Photos, Photos, Fonto, and YouTube Studios. Fonto, I haven't downloaded my fonts yet because I only had this one for a week and I haven't gotten the chance to. And then my YouTube studios is just my YouTube analytics, my views and everything, just the basics. And then we have customization, which is just widget screen. I mean, which is widget smith, eye screen and shortcuts. I haven't used shortcuts yet because I don't, I wasn't, I haven't been in the mood yet to like fancily customize my apps. And also, I don't like how, like, the shortcut thing pops up every time you use shortcuts. Because I've customized my sister's phone before. And I don't like how it just says that every time. So, I'll pause on that. And then I have games. I have Candy Crush, Animal Restaurant, Cat and Bread, Subway Surface, and Cat and Soup. As you can see, most of these games are cat-related because I like cats. But, yeah. And then we have Apple Store, which I feel like is the same for everyone. Apple Store is the same as Google app. But like here, I have some of the apps I didn't have or I couldn't find on Google Play Store, which I'm like, why are gatekeeping apps? Then the next app is the load shedding notifier. Oh my gosh, I'm running out of breath. And I forgot my water in the kitchen. Wow, not me forgetting my water in the kitchen, but load shedding app is because I live in South Africa, meaning load shedding happens. So this is just an app for me to know when load shedding is going to be in my area so I can charge my devices and not get bored for two hours. And the next load shedding will be at 8 until 10. So yeah, and then we have my clock app. Don't ask me why I have an alarm for half past 2 a.m. Mind your business. And then we have our last page, which has three things. So it has my entertainment folder, which is podcasts. And then we have podcasters, which is Spotify, for, podcasts for Spotify. And you guys should definitely follow me on my, uh, follow. You guys should definitely subscribe or like follow. I don't know what it is, but like do what, do what, do what it do is. Yay, London, you yo. <laughs> I don't know, my English is just running out. But yeah, I will have like my podcast here or here or here, wherever I have it. But yeah, you guys should definitely just listen to my podcast. And then we have our last folder, which is utilities, where I have voice memo, calculator, find my phone, books, contacts, weather, tips and fitness, plus FaceTime. FaceTime, I don't use because my friends don't have iPhones. And like, it's, FaceTime is almost the same as just like video calling someone on WhatsApp. So I kind of don't need it. And then the last app is Solitaire. 
I got solitaire like a few days ago when I got the phone because I like solitaire. It's like really fun and peaceful for me. Okay, it's not peaceful because I do get frustrated. But like it's really fun for me. It's like a fun game for me. So that's why I have it. And then at the bottom, I have the phone. The phone one. Safari, iMessages and Spotify. If you don't know, I'm a Spotify girlie. This is like my homepage. Like, good afternoon. My homepage and everything. And like songs I've listened to, albums I've listened to. Yes, I'm a Brent and Lana Del Rey person, girlie. Um, just top tier music from both of them. And then this, this is where all my playlists are, my library. So my playlist, don't mind the playlist names. Don't mind the playlist names. You're supposed to be creative. And then this is the app library, which is the last thing where it has every single app. Which is also every single app I showed you guys. So yeah, that is the end of what's on my iPhone. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It took, it took a while. I had to film this like three times. I filmed this video three times. And hopefully fourth time is the charm. This is the fourth time. And hopefully everything is not and good. Because I swear I am not going to film this again until tomorrow if i don't have what i want but yeah thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys next time don't forget to like and subscribe and if you made it this far comment down this emoji and i'll see you guys next time bye